Hey, what's up guys? It's Austin from Leadworthy. Today we picked out some Walmart steel and we're gonna see how strong is Walmart steel. We're gonna put the arsenal against it and see how it performs. Stay tuned. 22 long rifle, out of my long rifle. Oh, she's deadly. Canic nine mil. So far, nothing's happening. Okay, special. I fucking missed. <laughs> fucking missed. Yeah, I missed. 357 Magnum. Jesus Christ. I hit that mother. 38 special. Twenty-two. Just peeled the sticker. Nine mil peeled the sticker. Left a little jacket. And thirty-eight special. Just peeling sticker. Three fifty-seven mag. Bullseye, Bobby, folks. <laughs> yeah, bullseye. <laughs> At it again. This is what it looks like when you hit with the three fifty-seven. XD forty M. We well, got shot in the ass, but still no dimple. Kimber, 10 mil. <laughs> 10 mil, still no craters. Moving on. Five seven by 28. <laughs> All right, status report. 22, 9 mil, 38 special, 357 mag, 45, 10 mil, and 57 by 28. Still no dents. Pig's dead. So what'd you think about the piggy? Uh, it died like the rest of them do. Yeah, he ain't living no more. All right, shooting complete. So let's see what happened. Well, judging by it, she didn't last. 26 nozzle and 300 wind mag burnt straight through her. All right, what's up guys? Time for the final review. For the steel we bought at Walmart, with it being a Walmart product, I didn't have very high hopes. I thought for sure anything around a 45 ACP was going to crater it or dent it to where it's unsafe to shoot. And <laughs> it, it surprised me. What did it do for you? It definitely surprised me. I definitely thought when we started getting into the lower caliber rifle rounds that something would have happened more, but it, it held out great. Yeah, it did. I mean... We literally shot within 10 yards, everything from 22 long rifle up to 357 mag, 10 mil, nothing. Then we backed up to 80 yards. We were gonna go to 100, but we said, let's push it a little bit. 80 yards and it took everything, everything we sent at it from 6.5 Creedmoor, the next step up would be a 6.5 Norma. So a 6.5 Creedmoor Magnum down, no problems. I'm honestly surprised. And just like that, guys, it's a wrap. Thanks for joining Leadworthy. Stay tuned for the next video. Happy holidays.